Absolutely. You know, it's always fun to come out here and work against teammates and stuff, but uh, I think most of the guys would say the same thing. We're kind of ready to hit somebody else. One of the things that Coach Spags talked about was, you know, trying to see if his guys can tackle. Training camp's different now. You guys don't get tackled out there. I guess this is good to not tackle out here, but what's it going to feel like for you to get tackled in the game too? That's that whole side. Of it. Yeah, I think it's different. You know, here you got guys coming up and trying to thud you and hitting you up high. A lot of times in the games, you got those safeties coming, trying to get your ankles and knees for some of us bigger guys. So, uh, uh, but it's fine. You know, you get good workout here still too. You know, sometimes in short yardage goal line, we go live. Um, not that that's like really crazy tackling, but that's still going live. But yeah, I think we'll be excited to get out there and uh, especially the defense hit some dudes. Like, is your role change? Does not have to pull back? Does your role change at all? Uh, not really. Um, you know, there might be some stuff when we move around a little bit, but um, Coach Mel and office of staff doing a great job of kind of moving all of us around a little bit. Noah, you see him back there doing stuff, um, doing a great job. And uh, we've got a great room, so all the guys can do everything. You mentioned guys are going to, you know, chop that shell out when they're going out there. And it seems like everybody tries to do that Travis. Do you kind of get why, you know, sometimes Travis is like, okay, mess it up? Yeah, I think so. I mean, after a while, uh, you know, you got guys coming. And, and listen, I get it. You know, the defensive staff is preaching, get the ball out, get the ball out. And it's training camp. You know, you get in the dog days a little bit and the heat's going. And, uh, you know, someone catches you right in the rib, you might you might get a little feisty. So I'm sure that's what happened. But uh, I know he's talked to the guys, and um, it is what it is. Last year, you got injured in the preseason. You lost a lot of the year. How much better are you feeling now? How, how excited are you to be healthy at this time of year? I'm feeling good. I really am. Um, you know, just trying to get back this offseason, trying to stretch and, and uh, you know, keep my body loose a little bit. Um, but, yeah, I'm feeling good. Uh, such a freak injury, and and uh, the doctors did a great job last year getting me fixed up, and uh, uh, the trainers did a great job too as well. So I'm feeling great, ready to roll. How frustrating was that process last year for the team doing so well, and you're pushing to get back, and you're able to watch it? Yeah, it's, it was it was hard, but uh, you know that was my goal each and every day, is trying to get better and and try to stay focused because you know some of those days you come in and you're like, man, what am I doing? I'm not playing. Uh, but that's how those injuries work, man. You just gotta keep your head down and keep fighting and uh, work to get back on the field. We're watching Patrick work on his behind the back kind of stuff. Are there things we're gonna see in this offense this year? Is it evolving to even more fun things? We call them fun. You might call them challenging, but do you see more things coming out of this offense that could surprise people? Yeah, I mean, always. You know, I think that's what's great about the, the offensive staff. They're always thinking, you know, you see the the uh, ring around the rosy deal and plays like that. Um, that's why they do such a great job. And then all of a sudden they give it to us. And, you know, Pat does a great job of just making everything fun in the huddle and, and doing these type of plays. So you never know. We'll see. How hard is it to catch it behind the back pass? You never know where 15's throwing it, so you got to be ready at all times. <laughs> how many tight ends could be on the field at one time for you? Well, I always say, you know, I don't know how many we got six. I'd like all six of us if we could, but, uh, you know, I know we got 13 personnel, we got 14 personnel, so, uh, but if you ask any of us tight ends, we want as many as we can on the field at all times.